day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. Start this, brothers. I gotta check out on y'all. All right, good brother. Enjoyed it. And peace out. So, yeah. All right. I love you, bro. Thank you, man. Love y'all too, Chris. Yes, sir. Yeah, check this out. Read this for me. This is dealing with the using His name, but it's about how God moved without you saying in Jesus' name. But you do do imply that does indicate we're doing it under his authority. So check that out. This is Acts 10, 34. Okay. <clears throat> then, he, then Peter opened his mouth and said, of a truth I perceive that God is no respecter of person. Amen. But in every nation, he that feareth him and worketh righteousness is accepted with him. That means every and, nation. Yes. The word which God sent unto the children of Israel preaching peace by Jesus Christ he is Lord of all that word I say ye know which was published through all Judea and began from Galilee after the baptism which John preached yes sir how God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost well, and with power, with power. Who went about doing good Good. And healing all that were oppressed of the devil. Yes. For God was with him. He who had these good. Yep. Healing all that were oppressed of the devil. And we are witnesses of all things which he did both in the land of the Jews and in Jerusalem, whom they slew and hanged on a tree. Mm. Him God raised up the third day mm. and showed him openly. Yes, not sir. all the people, not to all the people, but unto witnesses chosen before of God. Yes. Even to us who did eat and drink with him after he rose from the dead. Well. And he commanded us to preach unto the people and to testify that it is he which was ordained of God yes. to be the judge of the quick and the dead. Yes, sir. To him give us all prophets, witnesses, all prophets witness that through his name, through his power, yes, sir. Whosoever believeth in him shall receive remission of sin. Amen. I mean, really, through, uh, through his authority. Through his authority. Yes, sir. Keep going. While Peter yet spake these words, the Holy Ghost fell on all them which heard the word which is something else that I saw in my study, that Jesus just preached the gospel. Yes, sir. Nothing else. Do good. And the Holy Spirit fell upon all those that heard the gospel. Yes, yes sir. And they of the circumcision which believed were astonished. Yes. As many as came with Peter because that on the Gentiles yes. also That's was poured out the gift of the Holy Ghost. Come on. For they heard them speak with tongues and magnify God. Then answered Peter, Can any man forbid water that these should not be baptized which have received the Holy Ghost as well as we? Yes. Uh huh. And he commanded them to be baptized in the authority of the Lord. Yes. Then prayed they him to tarry certain days. Amen. You see, like you said, preaching the gospel, but I think if we can leave this for the people today, is when we say his name, we're saying his authority. And that's where that authority allows you, Elder, before you fall asleep, it <laughs> allows you to do Google power. You want to go to the hospital, you go under the authority you see what I'm saying, brother? That makes it, that just changed the whole emphasis of it, don't it? We're sitting there worried about how we say it. And we need to understand what authority we're saying it in. Yeah, we do. And, and you know, I was thinking about that, 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 that centurion 
He said, I'm a man of authority, Brother Addison. He said, yeah. I'm a man under authority. I understand where you, look, did you catch that? Y'all remember that, right? I ain't gonna show that scripture, but yeah. I made sure it for the, he said, Elder, he said, I understand where you coming from because I'm a man under authority, Brother Addison. Yes. Speak the you word know, only. When, when, when we speak, Elder, if if we were to go in that hospital, Woo. we spoke healing to a patient. Yes. We're not speaking to that patient. We're speaking to the demonic forces that are attacking that person. Yes, sir. They already know the authority that we're coming in. They recognize when oh, Jesus walked in the room, they know. Come on. So if you speak to the demonic forces that have that person oppressed laying in that bed. I believe there is a there's a there's a lifestyle that prerequisite to that. I believe there's a level of submission that that's demonstrated is, is observable. And I remember one of the things that Christ said, he said this kind go out only by crying, prayer, and fasting. Yeah. And that was to that particular situation that they couldn't deal with. So there there are some, there's positioning issues, I think, with the individuals in the church, positioning on a, on a personal note. Yeah. Considering my relationship with Christ that allows me access to that power that he's already, you know, he, he's already appropriated for us. Yeah. And that is where we as a people have a problem. When I say a people, I mean sons, sons of God, members of the kingdom of God, is that we're still learning the method by which we, are, we position ourselves, how it is, and he's teaching it to us how yeah. it is that we can be at his beck and call in a sense. Yes, sir. What do we yeah. have to minister to him that he might use us? Yes, sir. And that's, I mean, that that for me really is the, uh, on a personal note, that's my problem. Hey, look that, the, the one scripture that says he was sold to the flesh, there was the flesh reap corruption, but he was sold to the spirit, to the spirit reap life everlasting. I'm still learning how to sow to the spirit. Hey, Elder. 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 I'm gonna interrupt you on that, and I got a revelation from what we just said when we talked about a few minutes ago about the uh, disciples said, "Why can't we cast that out?" You don't believe? Hey, hey brother, brother Addison, this is a revelation he gave me. That was the problem. It was you. You yeah, just said, yeah. "Why we?" Opposed yes. to why. Why, why could I do it? I should have done it under the authority mm -hmm. of God. So it, that it, it, God, the, the authority that they were sent out for, they at first they walked in that authority. authority. Then I believe they got the big head. Yes, they did. Remember that? You know they did because they asked And, and also, the, 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 the situation <laughs> to where they came to that was when they spoke to those demonic forces before. Yeah. They did pay attention and listen and things happened. Exactly. But this child started having fits. Uh-huh. And, 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 and was 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 fumbling around and yeah. and written itself and everything. And when they did that, they were like, whoa, they ain't yeah. listening. Yeah. And so they were like, we, we can't cast this out. Because mm -hmm. when Jesus came, he did the same thing. And put it out, right. But Jesus but, no, it, it mean, started acting up the same way. Oh, he started acting up Jesus, Jesus said. Yeah, but Jesus spoke to it and, yes. and, and cast him out. So <laughs> they they did try to operate in themselves and they did, you know, once they got resistant from the devil, they did come into themselves. Yes, sir. Instead of staying in that authority that they had. And, exactly. and then repeating themselves. Because even Jesus had to send the man to the to the uh to the river uh -huh. to wash his eyes twice. <laughs> you know, when he when he put the spittle in, yeah. in his eyes and he said, Go wash her again. Wash her. How, how do you see? <laughs> I see the men as trees walking. Yeah, and how does he know what a tree and a man walking looks like? Exactly. He's blind from birth. Yeah. <laughs> so who told him that? Okay. Hey, but the power, like it's like I said, it's, it's that we got to get out of the way. 
and under operate under his authority. And that's what he was warning us to watch out. People will come under their name. In other words, their authority, not yeah. his. Yeah, they, would, they would use his literal name, but not his authority. Yeah. And, and, and actually, his authority is God's authority. And I don't think we have access to that authority except we submit. Well, well you know, I, I want you to, I agree with you there. That, 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 that should be a given. But the, the, the submission is, is the renewing of the mind. When you yeah, renew your mind, is the only the only time you understand the authority that you walk in. And I think you know, when he says submission too, because I'm, I'm going to say after, when I say submission is submission to the authority. What you <laughs> mean is submission? Because if it's submission, submission to the authority, mind, and, yeah. and, and, and that's the thing that took me to some of the harder places that I had to go in Christianity. It, it, to love your enemy, to bless them, to curse you, to forgive, you know, indiscriminately so. I mean, you're not without seven, seven times 70. Those are places of submission that the Lord requires us to go to. Mm -hmm. but, you know, the you. first thing we do, Elder, is when those situations and circumstances come up, we look at ourselves. Yeah. We, yeah, I mean, yeah. we, we examine yeah. ourselves yeah. I mean, immediately. Yeah. And, and, and understandably, you know, we, we, we operate out of the flesh, man. You better get on out of here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Instead of, you know, you don't know what you're saying. You don't know, basically, you don't know who you're talking to. <laughs> Come on. Whoa. You know, my aunt told me something, and I, and I won't forget it. She said she was walking down the street, and she was a very, very strong Christian. Knows who she is in Christ. She said she was walking down the street, and these guys... <laughs> that were working on construction, started whistling and stuff at her. And she said, boy, you don't know who you whistling at. Woo! You don't know the authority that I'm walking in. And and she said that to them and went on about her business. And they didn't, they, they, it just knocked them back. Almost like when Jesus said, I am. Yeah. And they fell back, you know, fell back, back. You said something earlier. When we walk in that third, we're literally speaking to the spirit realm. Yes. Because when the sons of Sheba attempted to cast out that, they didn't have any authority in the spirit realm. They could no. talk to the God, but they couldn't talk to them demons that was empowering them. Come on, man. And I think that that is, for me, that has been a drive, even in the inner big perspective, to see us submit to the Lord that we can command, in a sense, that authority. Because yeah. we're not going to rise up and overthrow. God is not even going to allow that to take place. I pray it doesn't anyway, because there had to be a manifestation of something greater than just human strength. Yeah, you know, yeah. one, one strong yeah. man overwhelms another strong man. So what? The yeah. next strong man going to come along and overwhelm him. But what I would pray is that the power of God is demonstrated through our actions. Yeah. Is that in us submitting to him and following his prescript, his, his, his conscript or prescript, that he would be evident his presence and his activity in the situation would be evident so i guess that's what throws me back to you know the christ thing more so than to the black lives matter i don't want him to miss jesus in it the reason this happened was because jesus was dealing with it because when that happens when he's glorified and pointed out then i know he's going to move and he'll well, move in a that does not yeah. require us to, to, to do anything damage yes sir. i'm sorry well, the, the, the movement is for us is to walk in the authority that Christ has given us with that with the mindset of all men all you know all black black lives men yeah so when we walk we speak to the demonic forces that are attacking that so we have to realize in the revelation that I've got now on the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, They're not carnal. but are mighty. mighty. So we're speaking to the spirit realm Amen, man. that is controlling the the response of the individual or the actions of the individual. So when someone comes at you, Uh, influenced by demonic forces, we we already know that that's the realm that they're operating under. You know that they're they're influenced by because if it's not lining up with love, mm -hmm. right. then it's of demonic force, and we already know to speak 
to the driving force behind it. Amen. Satan, get behind me. Amen. Amen.